What's going on, everybody? So, a little bit of a mail day video. We haven't done one of these in a while because I've been doing a lot of shows, getting a lot of other stuff done. Gotten some breaks with G1. Huh, forgot to take my light down here. So, rookie mistake. We keep making rookie mistakes here. So, we're going to go through it real quick here. Nothing real crazy out of it all. This was our revolution. I was in a serial number break, I believe, with this. Um... Well, I have 50 cents stuff I'm just going to put in the boxes. Morantz, Pickens, clearly. Don Russ, two rookies. Kenneth Walker, clearly. Corral, clearly. Um, I'm not even going to read the ones that are not really worth it. Oh, there's two here. Kind of like stuck together. Oh, I see what he did. He just put them all into one. Ha! Ah! All right. Uh... I what that's called. Sunburst? Yeah, Sunburst out of 75. Kelton Johnson. Uh, Astro Coloco. Sunburst Coloco. Two Kenny Pickett's. We'll look at Graydon. That's cool. That's why I was getting into it to get a couple bases. Corral. Passing the torch, Jack Lambert. A lot of people, I don't know if I told the story ever on here. But my very first autograph as a young kid, I mean, probably like five years old, was from Jack Lambert. There we go. So I was from where the Steelers always hold their training camp every summer, St. Vincent College. And this guy was like all over the TV doing commercials and stuff. And I was just a fan. Don't know why. Probably because he was like the commercial guy locally. Well, remember going down to St. Vincent College, waiting for all the players to go in. Watch all the players exit, and we figured out there was a back exit. Went back there, another um, people were staying the other side, and this guy waited probably an hour or two after everybody left to come out. Finally came out, did some autographs for me. I was really stoked because he kind of did like a walk scene. Some people went back in. He's like, uh, just want to go eat, guys, you know, type deal. But it was really cool. He took the time to autograph for me. So whenever I see these and get them, it just brings back that first piece of childhood memory. All right, Corral Blue out of 99. Possibly go get great. I don't know if he'll ever start. TJ Watt out of 175. DJ Moore out of 49. And one iMac break. Had a serial number. Got the Pickens. Man, I was thinking, I was hoping. Pick it. But we take a Pickens. Uh, I think these are like a buck and a quarter, buck fifty, probably somewhere around there. So not bad. I think I was only in it for like oh maybe thirty bucks or something. So we'll definitely take the win on that there. So pretty cool overall for a quick mail day to look at. A lot more going back to sorting every time stuff comes in. Other than that, guys, I am out. I will catch you guys next video.